everyone, I'm back with another video. This is my December favorites. I hope you guys had a great December and a good start off to the new year, 2016. That's pretty crazy. So yeah, let's jump right into it. So I know you guys heard me talk about this product a lot, but I don't think I've ever posted on my YouTube channel. So this is Bush de Noel and it is from Lush, a face wash. This is their Christmas edition. Um, you only get this every winter and it definitely is my favorite face wash from Lush by far. I think the next, uh, the closest one to this is Let the Good Times Roll, but I love this one a lot more because it's more moisturizing and more hydrating. Um, if, I think if you're oily skin, I don't think you would enjoy that much just because it does leave your face feeling very um, moistured. So I don't know really know how to explain it, but it makes your face feel like it's really oily, but it's not. It's just a lot of hydration to it. And yeah, if you do want to try it out, I say give it a go. I've never tried it on my body, but I've tried it on the face and I love this. I waited like two years for this because I couldn't get it last Christmas. So I'm really excited that I got it this Christmas. I think they also have this on their website, but I'm not 100% sure if it's sold on their website. So yeah, I've recently talked about this like a few videos ago, but I'm gonna bring it back. Or maybe I wrote it on my blog. This is the Smashbox Camera Ready CC Cream. Love this product a lot just because it covers, it looks hydrating, it corrects your dark spots, it has SPF, and I don't know, I think I like this a lot more than their BB cream. I feel like their BB cream is, or their water cream thingy looking. Um, I've tried both of those and I did not enjoy it because it just makes your face kind of too matte and I think this doesn't have that matte finish. Um, so I think that's why I like it. I like a dewy look. This is definitely my holy grail for CC cream. I have been using the Innisfree Jiju Sparkly Mineral Essence. Love this stuff. Um, I bought one for my sister then this came in as well so I decided to give myself a try and this is supposed to deliver moisture into your skin while helping brighten the skin. I definitely believe that this brings a lot of moisture. I put this on before my moisturizer after your toner and um, it just gives your face a different feel in the morning, a different look. It does brighten your skin, it does make your skin look more hydrated and it definitely gives you more of um, benefits to your moisturizer. If you feel like your moisturizer is too is not that thick, then this would definitely help it as well. Um, I think overall having this in my routine has really helped my skin a lot as well. Just making it not break out at all, which has been amazing. So yeah, and then that, um, if you haven't tried an essence, I would give it a try. I know Sephora has been carrying a few beauty, Korean beauty products, and they're pretty pricey, but they're worth it. Skincare is always worth it compared to beauty, um, and compared to makeup. So this is definitely something you should try in your routine. This is Simple's um, eye makeup remover or makeup remover. Yeah, makeup remover. So I've been loving it because it's free, eco-friendly, and you do not have to wash your face after using this. You can just wipe your makeup and it's clean. I think that's like super great for days where you feel like, oh, I don't really wanna do my whole face thing or like wipe a lot of makeup off. Um, this is very great, especially when you travel. I used this when I went camping and it was wonders because when you go camping, you can't just go and wash your face. So this is the product to have because when you go camping, you don't need to wash your face after using this because it cleans your face as well when you're wiping your makeup off. So I've been really loving this since September. It lasts me quite a long time. So as you can see, it is like almost done. Kind of sad. I don't think I would go back to it because there are a few new makeup removers that I've been wanting to try. So yeah, if you don't have any that you really like, then I would say give this one a go. Or if you are looking for a new one, give this one a go. I've been trying the Neutrogena, um, the foam, the cleanser, the wipes, and I kind of like this a lot better. Okay, last beauty product is the ColourPop 
Solo. Um, that's the name of this color. It is like a pinky nude, but pinky. I don't know how to describe it. It's like a nude, a pinky nude, but not really pinky. It's also like a salmon a coral pinky. I love this color for everyday wear. I wore this in my no makeup makeup tutorial. If you've not seen that, I'll link that down below so you can see it. But it's great. I always get a lot of compliments. Everyone always asks me, what are you wearing? But this is the trick. It is $6 for this amazing ultra matte liquid lipstick. It's worth it. The formula is great. I feel like for this color, the formula is great. For the other colors that I've tried, the formula is a little bit too drying. But for this one, for some reason, it's not drying. It's very hydrating. And I would say it does come off when you're drinking, eating and stuff. But it doesn't come off as in like a lot where you have to reapply it. It just kind of goes into a more velvety matte um, lipstick. So yeah, I've been loving this a lot. If you haven't tried or purchase anything from ColourPop, I would say definitely give it a go. They have a lot of great reviews. For formulation, I do think that it is can be a little bit too drying if you have really dry lips or you have really chapped lips. Okay, so my last uh, favorite, not non-beauty related, is the Covet Fashion app on your phone, if you have an Apple phone. So right now, uh, Emma Roberts is hosting the fashion app. Basically on the app, what you do is you have style challenges, you go and just create outfits for it, have people rate it, and then you can win prizes, uh, you win outfits, and then the more money you have in your closet by winning outfits or just by purchasing stuff for the style challenge, you get like free makeup, like in the app, okay, not real life. You get like a free look, um, you get free hairstyles, like the more you improve, the better your hairstyle, your makeup style looks, and the, not improve, but the bigger your closet is. But, so yeah, this is my favorite fashion app. I think I just like it because I have so much creativity and freedom to do in this app. Doesn't matter because everyone has like a very different sense of style, so you vote on people's looks as well, and it's like really interesting. But really cool because you get to see like, oh, I never thought about that outfit. So i just been loving that a lot. So a hair product that I've been loving is the Living Proof Perfect Hair Day 5-in-1 Styling Cream. So I got this at as like the 100 points reward for Sephora and I've been loving it like a lot. So I had to go buy a travel size one. They, it comes with a... Um, it comes with a shampoo, cleanser, this, and their dry shampoo. Uh, I love them all. The dry shampoo, I'm kind of iffy about. It has like some product crumbles in your hair. Not crumbles, but gives your hair that like hairspray kind of feel. So I didn't like that as much. But their 5 in five and 1 styling treatment is amazing. Their shampoo and conditioner, oh my gosh, it's the only reason why my hair is like nice and fluffy and not looking dead or feeling dead because if you dyed your hair many times in one week you know that your hair is brassy I just kind of use it on my hair especially the ends of my hair so when it says perfect hair day it definitely is a perfect hair day so what I do is um, well what you have to do is you have to put this on while your hair is damp and then you blow dry it and I like to blow dry my hair but then I also like to flip my hair down and blow dry it and then flip my hair back um, and then your hair is like boom, voluminous, like amazing voluminous. And it's not like where it's like all over the place. It's just like a nice, soft, shiny, voluminous hair that's flattering. You just don't want to go to bed or have the day end because you just want your hair to be that perfect every day. So I've been loving it. If you want to try this and was skeptical or iffy, give it a try. Um, if you're looking for a hair treatment, this is your girl. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoy my December favorites. I'm sorry if it's not super long or not a lot of review products and stuff like that. If you want me to do a certain review on this product, I can. Um, but other than that, I hope your new year was amazing. Going 2016, we can do this. So yeah, bye!